despite the anti-hazing act, hazing continues to be performed by fraternities. Uh, can you give us the context in which the hazing law has actually been effective or not? Uh, at least I will speak for our fraternity. Uh, in our case, we are, uh, we would like and we are trying to follow the law. Now, since it was uh, promulgated last year, 2018, uh, we talked with our fraternity brothers and sisters that to stop hazing altogether. But we cannot do that overnight. Because even if we tell them... Uh, it's we, a culture. Yes, it's a culture. And we cannot really... Uh, effectively monitor the others because we are all over the Philippines. So in this particular case, we need also the uh, help of the schools mm -hmm. and also the, the authorities to... So <coughs> yung yung na ito po ay nagsasabi nga na may mga reporting and everything, so it helps a lot. Now in our case, gumaw gumawgawa na kami ng aming APO pledge program. Sinisimplify na namin kasi dati we already we already had that in compliance with the, the first mm -hmm. anti-hazing law. Ngayon, dahil napaka-stringent ang mga requirements ng bago, uh, ina-adapt namin yun sa yung aming uh, uh, Apple Pledge Program para sa bago nating uh, batas. Okay,